Today we're making you a fun ingredient chicken and beet meal prep. It's so delicious and with Valentine's Day coming up, we wanted to make sure we threw some bread in there. You know what we should call this meal prep? What? My heart beats for you. That's so lame. <laughs> so, so, let's get started. Set your oven to 400 degrees Fahrenheit or 200 degrees Celsius. To start, we're gonna peel and cut up the beets. In beetroot. Beets. Beetroot, mate. What's a beetroot? Beetroot. Beetroot. Straight up, stand up. Beets. It's a beetroot. So all you're gonna do is take a peeler and go like this. Ooh. Wow, look at the color. Seriously, how beautiful are beets? You can eat the skin if you'd like, but we are just gonna peel them off. If you haven't already, <laughs> if you haven't already subscribed to our channel, make sure that you do. This whole channel is a lot of Adam and I making fun of each other and funny jokes and us having a good time and also a whole lot of meal prep. Go hit that little button so you can join us every Sunday. <laughs> it's so funny. Look, I like looks like I killed somebody. Seriously though, look at that. How beautiful is that? Oh, look at that. It looks like wood. My heart beats for you. Oh wow. It doesn't matter how you cut these, you're just trying to make small chunks of beets. A beet's like a giant purple potato. Mm-hmm. Now, we're gonna take a bowl and put our beets into the bowl. To the beets, you're gonna add two tablespoons of balsamic vinegar. <laughs> Two tablespoons of olive oil. Just gonna add some salt and pepper. You can either use your hands or you can just use a spatula and just give it all a mix. Look at that. Now we're gonna take a pan that is lined with either some tin foil or a baking mat and we're just going to add the beets on top. Spread it out. This is so perfect for Valentine's Day. Adam. Mm-hmm. If you didn't buy me any chocolate and you just gave me red beets, I'd know you love me. You're looking after my heart. My real heart, not my emotional heart. Okay. Now we're gonna put this in the oven in the bottom rack for 40 minutes. Boy. Okay, so now we're gonna do the chicken. We're gonna cut it in half. Same washing up, you can put it in the same bowl as before. You can go in there, you can go in there. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Then to that, we're gonna add some olive oil, two tablespoons. We're gonna add some salt and pepper. A tablespoon of Italian seasonings, or any seasoning, that's basil, oregano, thyme, any of those will do. A tablespoon of that, beautiful. Because it's Valentine's Day, we want some of those aphrodisiacs. Mm. We're gonna put in some red pepper flakes. Ooh. Half a tablespoon. I want that heat on Valentine's Day. That's the one. Now mix it all together. <laughs> now take your chicken breasts and lay them onto your bacon tray. Put the cut side down. Put the chicken in the oven and top wrap. So a second timer in 15 minutes. This might just be the easiest meal prep we've ever done. That's it. We we're like done. don't even know what to do with ourselves right now because we're done. That yeah. means you can start preparing the meal and then go like snuggle on the couch. Have a nice glass of wine. <laughs> or you just go Netflix and chill. Oh wow. Or meal prep and chill. Oh wow. Oh, the meal prep and chill. Hey. This is the perfect recipe for meal prep and chill. That's right. <laughs> so now we've got 14 minutes till the chicken's done and we still got 24 minutes until the beets are done. You got plenty of time to go to Amazon and get our book. All of you love the book, 12 weeks of meal plans Meal prep, just like this, you guys are gonna love it. <laughs> Time to get the chicken out. Mm. Perfect, perfect. Cut the cook, see you touch it. It's firm, doesn't bounce back, you know it's done. Yay! We even got a little pink in the chicken from the balsamic vinegar to make it Valentine's Day. That's right. Dance party? Dance party, I'll dance party. Let's do it.
are dancing it out. Here we go. Oh, look at the beats. Here we go with the beats. Oh, wow. Beautiful. Look at those beats. Give them a bit of toss. Move them all around. It's cool. We're going with our walnuts. Mmm. Walnuts. Half a cup of raw walnuts. Beautiful, beautiful. And we're going to go in and finish them off for another five minutes. Okay, put it back in the oven. Here we go! Woo! Wow. Oh, oh, guys, look at that. You know what I love? How many of you comment and say that when you take something out of the oven now, you either whistle or you go, oh wow! Wow! <laughs> Ready to plate it all up. Add one piece of chicken to each container. Then divide the beets and walnuts evenly among the containers. On top of that, you're gonna sprinkle about one ounce of feta cheese. And for optional garnish, we're gonna add some basil. Easy as that, guys. So this recipe will help you get in and out of the kitchen as fast as possible on Valentine's Day, which leaves you tons of time to do other things on Valentine's Day. Like video games? Do worries on Fortnite. The couples that game together, stay together. Definitely not. Make sure you post your pictures over on Instagram. Hashtag Big Couple Cooks. Tag us at Big Couple Cooks. Have a great week. Bye, Bye guys. guys. Namaste.